Howdy ho family and welcome back to another episode of Bemusing Bill and I'm going to check out another Taylor Swift song so thanks for hanging out with me. The song's called The Man live from Paris. It makes me think of the Anthrax song by the same name but I know it's not <laughs> but uh, listen the link will be below in the box and if you'd like to support the channel all those links are below as well. Please share and like and subscribe and let's let's check this out i would be complex i would be cool they say i played the field before i found someone to commit to and that would be okay for me to do every conquest i had made would make me more of a boss to you I'd be a fearless leader, I'd be an alpha type When everyone believes ya, what's that like? I'm so sick of running as fast as I can Wondering if I'd get there quick or if I was a man And I'm... This is my first time checking out uh, Taylor playing guitar. I mean, I know she plays guitar and I think banjo and piano. Um, I don't know what else. I, I think there's other instruments that she plays. But this is um, the first time actually hearing her play guitar. I think it's really cool that she does. I don't, I mean, outside of, I, honestly, I mean, I, not that I know really much of pop singers, but uh, I don't I don't recall any other pop singers playing guitar. Now, of course, Lady Gaga plays uh, piano, but I don't, I don't know if she plays any other instruments. I'm not really familiar with, uh, very much of Lady Gaga, but, um, but I don't believe she plays guitar. I'm a guitar player. So therefore, of course I need to check out people playing guitar. I, I'm what you would call a guitar nerd, but, uh, yeah, she plays great and it's a nice guitar too. I believe that is what you call a dreadnought. This is a cool song. So this is live from Paris. And and I, I'm trying to catch the lyrics here. I know that there's lyrics down in, in the description box and, and under this link. So I will be checking that out later. But uh, I'm going to um, see how much I can catch here. Uh, even through the headphones, it's a little hard for me to, to, to catch everything she's saying. And that would be okay for me to do. Every conquest I had made would make me more of a boss to you. Ah. I'd be a fearless leader. I'd be an alpha type. When everyone believes you, what's that like? I'm so sick of running as fast as I can. Wondering if I'd get there quick or if I was a man And I'm so sick of them coming at me again Cause if I was a man Then I'd be the man I'd be the man So is she singing about like the double standard of You know, what a woman does versus the man doing the same thing And how they are um, perceived or looked at in society, you know, uh, at least that's what I'm getting from these first couple lines here, and I might be completely off. Be the man, I'd be the man. I'd be the man. They say I hustle, put in the work. They wouldn't shake their heads and question how much of this I deserve. What I was wearing. If I was rude, could I be separated from my good ideas and power moves? And they would toast to me, oh, let the players play. I'd be just like Leo in Central Bay. I'm wow. so sick of running as fast as I can. Wondering if I'd get there quick or if I was a man. And I'm so sick of them coming at me again. If I was a man, then I'd be the man, I'd be the man, I'd be the man, yeah. What's it like to brag about breaking in dollars and getting pictures and models and it's all good if you're bad, 
It's okay if you're mad If I was out flashing my dollars I'd be a bitch, not a baller They paint me out to be bad So it's okay that I'm mad <laughs> Yeah <laughs> Nice pause. I'm so sick of running as fast as I can. Wondering if I'd get there quicker if I was a man. You know that I'm so sick of them coming at me again. see if I can't I mean that pause was was brilliant and man the crowd's going nuts look at it there <laughs> so I mean I get it as, as far as that goes yeah there's definitely that's a long pause too wow and pictures and models and it's all good if you're bad it's okay if you're mad if I was out flashing my I'd be a bitch, not a baller They paint me out to be bad So it's okay that I'm mad oh. <laughs> That's right, suck it in, bring it in <laughs> You know, it's kind of reminds me of uh, seeing, you know, when they panned out on this is that she's like in a, what, it, I mean, I can't tell if it's, if it looks like she's like in a little circle by herself there, or if just the, the way the stage is right now, this reminds me of, um, if you guys ever seen Elvis back in like 67 or 68, he's all in black, I think like a black leather pants and, and a and a black button up shirt. He's playing a black, I believe. I could be wrong. But I, he's playing a guitar. He's by himself in a circle. And the crowd is going nuts around him. That's what this reminds me of. And we're talking about a good 50 some odd year difference, you know, but having that crowd like in her hands. And I wonder if there's like some kind of juxtaposition between Elvis and and Taylor in, in this sort of thing there. Let's see if um let's see if I can I can catch more of these lyrics here, see if I'm close or off base. I would be complex, I would be cool. They'd say they'd say I played the field before I found someone to commit to, and that would be okay. That reminds me like I don't know how it, things are nowadays, but like if you were a promiscuous woman, you were labeled a slut, right? If, but if you're a promiscuous man, you're a player, you're a stud. That's that's like the the uber definition of the double standard, right? Uh, for me to do every conquest I had made would would make me more of a boss to you. I'd be a fearless leader. I'd be an alpha type. When everyone believes you, what's that like? I'm so sick of running as fast as I can, wondering if I'd get there quicker if I was a man. So she's she's saying like you know that she has to work harder um, to prove herself, you know. I guess uh, 
than than if she was a man. You know, I don't know about that. I mean, maybe in a lot of circumstances, certainly. I could tell you that uh, very, very, very long time ago, uh, I dated a girl who was in an all-girl band, and I was in my all-male band. And I got to tell you, they got way more gig opportunities than we did. And I'm not saying that in any kind of jealous way or anything, but the doors are definitely far more open uh, for them. And maybe because at the time they were more, um, you know, it was more of a novelty. So people, you know, brought that in. But I think that in some ways they had an easier time. But I know in general, it's a lot harder for, for women to to make it in the business, make it in a lot of businesses, to be honest. We all know that. Um, I'm so sick of them coming at me again because if I was a man, then I'd be the man. I'd be the man. I'd be the man. They, they'd say I hustled, put in the work. They wouldn't shake their heads and question how much of this I deserve. What I was wearing, if I was rude. Uh, yeah, right. Yeah, that's women are so much more Oh, what she was wearing and what she said could all be separated from my good ideas and power moves and they would toast to me oh let the players play I'd be just like Leo and San Trapez chorus what's it like to brag about raking I didn't catch that part before I'd be just like Leo and San Trapez so is she referring to Leo DiCaprio in that I remember reading um, not long ago about something to do with Leo and I think he's got a foundation or something or it was something to do with with San Trapez. I'm not I don't I don't know. I don't follow that stuff. So I'm not sure. Hit me up in the comments and, and you know, you guys can fill me in. Um, I'd like to brag about raking in dollars and getting bitches and models. And it's all good. If you're bad, it's all good if you're bad, right? See, and it's okay if you're mad. If I was out flashing my dollars, I'd be a bitch, not a baller. They'd paint me out to be bad, so it's okay that I'm mad. I'm so sick of running as fast as I can, wondering if, if I'd get there quicker if I was a man. Um, then I'd be a man, then I'd be a man. So she just repeats the chorus. Yeah, so I think I'm on, on ball with that, don't you think? Don't you think I'm right on that? And uh, cool song. I like her energy. I like her voice in that, too. I like that, you know, she's she's not, like, cooking notes, you know, holding on these long notes or anything. It's straight. It's direct. The crowd is loving her. And and she's she's eating it up. She's controlling it. Awesome job. Great song. I really like this song. My second, my second Taylor Swift song here. And it was a banger, man. I dug it. So you Swifties out there, I mean, if you, if there's something else I should be checking out, if, if, um, you know, maybe she's playing with, with a full band or if she's uh, playing a different instrument or something like that, hit me up in the comments. And let me know. Uh, I dug it. I dug it. She's awesome. So until the next time, my friends, be good to each other. Be good to yourselves, and I love you guys. Peace.